Beginning February 13th and running through April 12th, Hasted Kreitler will be exhibiting new drawings and sculptures by Spanish artist Romulo Celdron. My works engage in particular with Klaus Oldenburg's playfully monumental sculptures, but rather than existing exclusively as impersonal objects, I integrate a subtle human presence, implied but never obvious, into my drawings and sculptures. For example, the bottle cap has been pried off, the ice cube tray was filled and spilled, the pencil was recently sharpened. The series title Zoom encompasses my drawings and it's almost like a camera lens. Getting a closer look at ordinary objects, I recreate the objects with so much detail one would not be able to see with just the human eye. I used to make color oil paintings, but with time I more and more felt the need to concentrate just on drawing and its black and white vision of reality. For me, it is a more minimalistic way of approaching objects without the distraction of color. The drawings are intentionally devoid of color to make a difference between my drawings and my sculptures, where color is evident and prominent. The series of sculptures is called Macro, and it recreates objects using a scale that is much larger than the real-life object. The exaggerated scale comes from the perspective of seeing the objects as if one were a child. Each object has been anthropologically rendered down to every detail, complete even the underside of the bottle cap. For me, it's also important not, not only to, to reflect the visible part of the object, but also the, the hidden part of, of it. Kind of respect for, for what the, the object is, not only a part of it, but the whole thing. I always use unexpected materials. The metal bottle cap, for example, is made of resin and foam board. The ice cube tray is not made of plastic. The hot water bottle is not made of rubber. Never made from a mold, its work is absolutely unique. Nothing is what it seems, as distortions of scale allow me to plumb the physical and material reality of our world in a more focused way. For example, this uh, this, this piece, you can think that is something flexible as a real one would be, but it's not. It's a, it's a hard surface. So for me, it's important to play with the spectator in, in relation to this concept that uh, you, you see something, but you don't know exactly what are you looking at. This water bottle could be empty, but for me, it's important that, in fact, it is full of water this sculpture is a good example of what I like to call the narrative of the static, which means that an object, even though it is in repose, it is telling us a lot of things about its existence, about how the work is right now, and how the work will be in a few minutes, and how the work will be in a few hours. And this kind of movement is something that for me, it's really important about this work. Each sculpture has my name incorporated in some way. In the sculpture of the bottle cap, the product is Ronthel, a combination of my first and last names, literally leaving my signature and artist brand on the work. View the works of Romulo Seldron at Hasted Kreitler from February 13th through April 12th.